Uh, my name is Giselle Gradilla. I am double majoring in secondary education with a concentration in English and English. Generation student Giselle Gradilla is also a Nepantla program sixth cohort scholar as well as the first student in the secondary education program to complete an honors thesis in English. Say Nevada State chose me a little more than I originally chose Nevada State. When it came to my senior year of high school and just like being in the existential dread of um, graduating high school and being a first-gen person. Um, NSC, I think, was mentioned to me by um, an alumni from the year prior to when I graduated, and um, the more I looked up NSC, the more it, it just felt like it would be a really great fit for me. Her thesis explores the use of testimonial as both experience and method to understand her own lived experiences throughout her education and life on her journey to become a teacher and shares recommendations for a potential program to support and empower first-gen, low-income, BIPOC students who are in high school. My entire community that I have built here um, have been super influential in my success. Dr. Molly Apple in the English department, um, the mentorship relationship that we developed has been foundational and um, really incredible for my work as a storyteller. Hola, doctora, gracias por todo. Um, thank you for being in community with me and um, for embarking on this journey with me. Her commitment to students through responsive approaches embodies the School of Education's mission to locally grow and effectively prepare teachers committed to advance justice and equity through improving education for all learners. I'd love to thank my family, my younger siblings, um, and my parents especially um, for all of the support that they have given, given me throughout this journey. I cannot stress enough how much, um, again, myself as a first-gen person, um, my story, my success is bigger than me, just like all of my other first-gen community members. Our, our stories are everything. Our stories are breaking generational curses.